different strokes for different folks, we say that. Mm -hmm. And how do I know which is the right stroke for this person at this time to help them guide themselves, find out what they should be doing? And it's a very unique concept. It's a very unique concept which requires your ability to do it with a lot of trustworthiness, honesty, calmness, tranquility, easygoing, attitude, nobility, uh, divinity, uh, a degree of almost a, a selfless situations in their lives. Because it is considered to be a noble profession because it hovers around the, the sapping of life where people are hovering where they are having a painful death, not because they're dying, but that deathly suffering what they're having is, is what is always entangled into what you're trying to heal. Them. And your ability to heal them, cool them down, channelize the truth, change their path, change their path. Because for this lady who was uh, into this uh, spiritual organization for 22 years in a very attached egoistic manner for me to look at her cough and tell her to quit her job has nothing to do with it, isn't it? But doing that is taking her life to a different level, changing her attitude about looking at her life and willing to change and that change and that flow is alleviate that suffering, the moment that Dukkha goes and the things start flowing, I'm sure that she will start breathing and coughing less. Because it's, it's almost holding things and blocking things inside. And I'm not saying that every disease is only of psychological origin. There are physiological traumas, problems, situations, infections, hundreds of different things. But you all have to understand and respect one thing that even if a trauma comes, that response to the trauma comes from the mind. Is that right? Mm 